There is a growing interest in Louisiana surrounding the magical number of 20. It relates to speckled trout of 20 inches long or longer. It's not actually a magical number, but that size of trout in Louisiana is uncommon. The last published Louisiana trout assessment showed that that size of trout is only 6% of the spawning biomass. And a 20 inch trout is somewhere around three to four years old. Oh my, oh my goodness. Whew, scared the crap out of me. Wow. Whew, this is a nice trout. Man, see how aggressive that thing was? Good gracious. Whew. Oh, this is a big fish. Dang. Could this be a 20? This is a big fish. Some of the public recognition for the 20 inch size trout I think has to be attributed to the Release Over 20 conservation program. So if you don't know about the Release Over 20 program, so I'm gonna go online, I'm gonna enter that one into the website and that'll put me in a drawing from some, re some really nice prizes. And also it releases that incredible spawner up to 2 million, 20 million eggs a year, puts it back into the system. The new Louisiana rules for speckled trout use the same length as the upper slot. So clearly it has some scientific basis and that's related to the spawning biomass of speckled trout. A 20 inch trout is in the prime spawning potential range of its life. When it's this long it can produce 10 to 20 million eggs per season which is at least 10 times as many eggs as it could produce when it was 12 inches long. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. Late winter and springtime is when most large trout are caught in Louisiana and across the entire habitat range of speckled trout in the U.S. In my opinion, there are two primary reasons for this. One, during these months, more large trout are living in locations with easier accessibility for anglers. Number two, there is more competition over food among a trout and other fish species, so these months make it easier to fool the large, more experienced trout. It is common knowledge that three and four year old trout are more readily caught on fin fish or fin fish imitations because a greater portion of their diet has shifted from shrimp to fin fish. Oh, I got one. Oh. If a live croaker needs to be hooked properly to convince a three-year-old trout to strike it, we can guarantee that the presentation of an artificial bait is critically important to getting a strike. It's 20, I believe, though. Is your, is your net right? It is not. Okay, I'm going to come up. Oh, that's a nice one. Where'd he go? Uh oh, here he goes. There we go. Oh yeah, that's a 20 for sure. Holy mackerel. Woo! Oh man, that is a beast. I just told you where to go find a 20. Man. That's what we were trying to do. 22 and a half inch trout. The best advice for catching three and four year old trout in Louisiana in the spring is to throw a topwater lure. This tactic may not garner as many strikes, but it is the most likely path to getting the one big bite that produces a trophy trout. Topwater presentations are most effective when the trout are near the surface either because they are feeding there or the water is shallow. The confounding factor is that trout tend not to feed on the surface under bright conditions which makes the topwater bait most effective in the morning and evening and on cloudy days. It seems like they're out here pretty far off, if this is them. And they're, they're just hitting it when it's still just sitting around. There, there's another one right there. There's not a, they are not aggressive at all. 
This is a decenter fish. A better fish. Yeah, they are so quiet today. Very gentle. This is a good fish. Uh, is it a three pounder? I don't know. He's got some, definitely got some weight to him. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This is not a. Oh, dude, that's a three pounder. That could be my first heavy hitter's fish right there. That is a freaking monster for us. Oh my, that's a nice fish. Yep. Oh yeah. So that 21 incher over three pounder came on the cutter, Berkeley cutter 110. The bigger jerk bait, I started to use this big one. It's pink, silver, and a little bit of chartreuse on the bottom. In addition to jigs, I would recommend having the ability to fish lip jerk baits in floating and suspending versions, lipless twitch baits in suspending and sinking versions, and the Paul Brown lures. At a minimum, you should have these lures in small and medium sizes and in a dark green or olive green color and a color pattern with pink. In conclusion, if you want to consistently catch three and four year old trout in Louisiana, do not spend all day fishing where you catch the one and two year old trout. Instead, fish the gnarly structures, the large channels, large shallow lakes, and the barrier islands. It also helps to lower your expectation about the number of trout you will catch. And just focus on achieving a half dozen big bites. Good luck out there. I hope you catch some of these big beautiful girls. And remember to release a few so that we can have 25 inch trout in just a couple years.